Hey guys, just a quick video. I'm going over this app called Transcribe Plus. This is normally an app that you use to slow down or change the pitch of a song. But something really cool in this app is that you're able to isolate parts of the song. It listens to the track and somehow it's able to figure out what the bass is doing, what the drums are doing, what the vocals are doing, and what the, all the other instruments are doing. So you can isolate those. It's really cool and figured I'd share it with you guys. So once you load the app, you'll click up here and then you can choose where you want to find a song from. I'm just going to choose something from my band in order to just avoid getting a copyright or anything. And there's a lot of parts that can separate with this as well. So with this song, let me fast forward a part. So you can change the speed. You can change the pitch of the song. So let me just put that back to normal. That's kind of what it was made for originally, but the really cool part about this is when you go up here and you click this part that says isolate vocals, bass, drums, and instrumentals, and it gives you the choice. Do you want four stems of vocals, bass, drums, and instrumentals, or do you just need certain parts isolated? So I'm going to go ahead and just do all of them just for the sake of the video. And it normally takes a while, but I already did this ahead of time. The song's about four and a half, five minutes, so it, it takes a while to isolate four different parts. But now... You have, let me go back to the beginning. So let me s mute everything except for the instruments. So, my, so this is kind of a weird project because it has, you know, soundtrack and, and dialogue and all sorts of ambient noises and stuff like that. So let me get to the part where there's a guitar. So it's got the guitar fine. You can see here, here's the vocals. I have this vocoder effect. If I want to mute that, I can mute it and now just listen to the guitar. Now you can hear it does that little glitch kind of thing where it's trying to figure out, I mean, you're going to get little artifacts like that, but just to be able to isolate parts of a song and then you can mix it for like a remix or you can use it to hear what's going on in the song, it's, it's pretty cool. So let me go back actually and I'm going to put just the vocals. So you can, you know, you can hear some of the, some of the weirdness going on with the phasing stuff, but it's still pretty cool that it's able to isolate this. Let me get to a part where there's a really heavy vocal part. Oops, that's not it. So there, this is, you know, an acoustic part. right here. And then here's the acoustic guitar that's going on underneath that. And again, you can hear kind of that phasing issue. But it's pretty wild how well that works. So that was done with female accompaniment. Her name's Ronit, awesome artist, check her out. But to be able to isolate that, to hear like, okay, what are the harmonies doing in this song? That's really beneficial to be able to listen to see what's going on with the instrumentals. That's really cool to hear what the drums are doing. Or, I mute everything, and the bass. You know, the bass is usually kind of a harder one to hear. You might not be able to hear this without headphones, depending if you're just on your phone. Pretty wild that it's able to, to isolate those parts. And then for drums, this song doesn't have drums until about this part. And it's able to get the drums out. So this is how the song sounds. It's able to get just the drum part. And again, you have that weird kind of phasing type of thing, but it's still pretty wild how well that works. It's just the bass. Pretty crazy how well that works. It's not perfect by any means. I don't think you're ever going to be able to truly get exact parts. I chose this track because it's one of my songs, so I don't get a copyright strike, but also because it's kind of a tough one. There's multiple parts going on with it, and it still is able to isolate. It's pretty crazy. And then what you do, you have to unmute everything in order to do this. You go back up here, and you just say export stems. And you can choose, do you want it to be lossless or you know MP4 or what format do you want? So if I do wave, for example, and then it's going to say, do I want to save it to my phone or do I want to airdrop it to myself or mail it to myself or whatever I want to do. It's, so yeah, whatever you guys want to do with this information, it's just it's just worth knowing. I use it to figure out parts that I'm having trouble hearing. It can also be used to make a remix. I also use this to remix some of my friends' songs. I'll take their vocals out and put it to Smash Mouth All-Star. So 
that in itself is well worth it. It's just really cool to be able to do all of that. There are little glitches. So like I tried this with Pour Some Sugar On Me by Def Leppard. I'm not going to play it because of copyright. But, you know, in the beginning, the gang vocals that go, hey, you know, way better than what I just did. But they do those haze at the beginning and it hits with the snare drum. So on the drum track, it kind of like cuts out the snare if you try to listen to that because it's it's trying to figure out that's kind of the haze are kind of a percussive type sound. And it's getting rid of the snare and the vocals. So it kind of sounds a little bit funky. So it's having trouble figuring that out. But you're able to, you're really able to figure out a lot of different parts on these songs. It's it's pretty crazy. So the way that I discovered this app, I actually did a video about slowing down music and um, Transcribe Plus reached out to me and said, hey, you should check out our app that we released. And I did. They weren't paying me to do it. They just mentioned to check it out. I was like, oh, this is really cool. And they sent me five free download codes to give to some of my fans. So the app is free. You get to list, You get to do all this stuff with the first 45 seconds, and then you have to pay for the upgrade. Right now, it's about $15. It's definitely worth it, in my opinion. But like I said, Transcribe actually sent me five free download codes. So I'm giving those away on my Instagram page. So go follow me over on Instagram at Scott Yule Music. You'll see my post about this, and the first five people who comment get a free download code for this. So it's pretty cool. Hope that helped you guys out. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Definitely helps out my channel. If you know any other apps that do some cool stuff like this, let me know. I'm definitely always interested in checking out new and cool technology. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Follow me on Facebook. I don't really like Facebook, but follow me on Instagram. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks.